All right, an early morning race. Well, not really early morning, but 10 a.m. I have done a total of two laps of practice and two laps of qualifying, and that was all done in this server. Uh, amazingly, starting on outside front row, but just barely could be easily back in 10th. Um, which is probably where we're going to end up with lack of practice, since I have no idea what this car is going to do after three laps. Um, so fix setup at Iowa. We're doing 40 laps, no cautions, the Arca series. And yeah, just got to keep the tires on it, which... Should be a little easier than last week at Rockingham. Just going to kind of run the middle. The gearing in this setup really sucks. So, might be able to get the top to work in three and four. Uh, haven't been up there yet. Not sure. We can usually get it to work decent in the trucks. But. Not sure here, we'll find out. Probably gonna go backwards at the start, but let's see what we can get. Get ready, going green. The pace car is off, be ready. Miss shift already. Let's see what we can learn from the one car and uh, go from that. Looks like it's middle line. Just got to keep the car under me. Got stupid loose in qualifying, wasn't ready for that. A little too high, gonna. Oh, it turned down. Thought it was gonna hit that bump up on the third lane into one. That thing really sucks. So, yeah, I don't even know what the tires do when you come up to temp. So, luckily, this appears to be a weaker field. That's net code behind. See a dude just monster truck it. Seems like the bottom's a little quicker, but probably a little rougher on the tires. I might be going too quick as well since it looks like I'm the fastest guy on track right now. Pretty sure that's not talent. It's probably lack of knowledge of the tires. I don't feel like I'm abusing them, but I didn't feel like I was abusing them at Rockingham either, so. Try the third lane while we've got a chance. Not bad. She a good run off the corner as well.
not trying to pass him right now, just kind of conserving. This track's really fun with the multiple different grooves you can go to. The bottom out of one or out of two can sometimes cause you to get pretty loose. Still pulling away from the people behind. feel like he's just burning up that right front on entry into one as hard as he's going in, but I could be wrong. Looks like my pass attempt has made him push it a little harder wasn't really a pass attempt, it was just he was going so slow that I ended up beside him. Still pulling away from the cars behind. Got wrecked cars into three. Totally screwed that corner up. Twenty four point five nine five. All right, let's see if we can reel them back in. Might not be able to. I think he was just conserving. Stick with this middle groove seems to be the quickest. Car on fresh tires coming out. That's going to be a bit annoying. Hopefully he pulls away quickly. Alright, might just be dropping off again. Thought I was fine on tires, but apparently I have no idea what I'm doing on tires.
two seconds behind, so they are closing in a bit. Let's see if this top's got anything at all. <laughs> Nothing. behind. All right, 2.0 behind. Not gaining on the leader, though. Pull up. Last lap. Way I can kind of search around, see if I can find anything quicker. better down there. Point eight again behind. Running out of laps to do anything at all. the tenth there overdriving. Pretty much key is don't overdrive. Entry so hard that you're pushing up towards the wall too early. I mean, maybe you want to get driving tips from the dude that's beating me by three seconds, but it looks like if you just get the left sides after a longer run just below the first seam, helps turn the car with the different banking. Helps you off the corner, you're not pushing too much. Kind of rotates the car for you. But at the moment, we are probably third quickest car, maybe fourth quickest car. Not sure about the six behind us.
car behind's running out of laps. He is gaining a ton of lap, though. Marks, not give up a big chunk of time, and should be able to finish second. Fairly boring race, but uh, sometimes that happens. Fastest guy on pole, second fastest guy second. The rest of the field falls back behind, trying to save tires. Seven obviously saved tires pretty well. Coming down to it. Two left to go. Two to go. Might be right at the line. Hopefully it's not another last lap. Uh, just dump the guy to get past him. I don't think he's even going to have to worry about dumping. He's just got super speed. Almost, but we finished third. Chicken flag, chicken flag. Well, good job. Once there again, job. ruined the tires. Didn't save it. Didn't have speed to keep up with the leader who didn't do anything to his tires. Just have to see if second place was uh, actually quicker than the leader. All right, let's take a look at those laps real quick from me, I was dying, 25 threes. 24 nines in front, and then 25 ones, so leader was just quick everywhere. He was fastest guy on track. I've still got some work to do to figure out these tires. Uh, burn up the right front. Did not even think I was doing that. Down to 59. It's terrible. But, uh, yeah, P3. Disappointing P3. Not sure I could have done anything better. So close. But is what it is. That guy had a 73 on his right front, so he conserved much better. But hope you enjoyed that. Learned a bit. Don't drive like me. Apparently, I was overdriving once again. So thanks for watching.